Strawberry Earth is all about creative people helping the environment. So we work with bloggers, uh, with fashion designers, uh, with musicians, uh, with uh, yeah, all kinds of creative people. <laughs> One of the best feelings about doing Strawberry Earth is having people come up to you and say, I've actually changed my lifestyle because of one of the films that we've seen or because of uh, one of the articles that we've read on the blog. <laughs> the time of all these doom and gloom scenarios, Inconvenient Truth, for example, I mean, these films were necessary to wake people up. But I think we're in the next step. Now people know that something's wrong and that we should really do something about it. So what we try to do is to offer films that are that are solution based. You can spend your money and know that the places you love to go, like a cinema or a hotel or a bar, you know that the bar is going to be more environmental friendly. So the more drunk you get, the better the night you have, the more sustainable the place is going to be. And that's why I like working for Strawberry Earth. <laughs> As a human, you're aware of your decisions. And I think a lot of people think like, yeah, but there are millions of people and everybody does the wrong thing. So it really attracts me that there is a group of people who say, no, you can be different. So many of the buying decisions that we have here have impacts all over the world. And you could see more connections between um, climate change and social justice. We don't believe in the whole 70s vibe of forcing people to change their lifestyle. And I have friends who are not green at all, and they're still my friends. So we're not too aggressive. The thing I really want to see uh, happening is, well, maybe in the end that we don't have to be there anymore because people, yeah, they don't need us anymore to, to have a different lifestyle. Yeah, met the photo. Met the room. Yeah, a greener place. Also. Now, little, okay. My personal reason. It's so easy, but it's so difficult. I don't know how to say it. Um, 